Thank you for watching. This video is going to show you how to use Cubase 7.5 with Harmony option. And as you can see uh, in my video here, I already has lots of Harmony, uh, Soprano, Alto, and Tenor. And uh, how do I did that? First, you need to have a voice, right? Voice recording. And once you have voice recording, and you can actually add Harmony, say, this is my voice recording. Okay, you can start in front of here you can see here the voice okay so this is the voice okay so I'm going to actually add the uh, um, three different uh, harmony and or more in Cubase how do I do that just highlight the voice here and choose select all events okay and just go to the uh, audio here the top menu here and go to the uh, generate harmony voice Okay, because I already have harmony here, it's already generated, so it might show something uh, error message. But I'm going to show you just uh, uh, how to do that. Uh, add audio and uh, okay, see the harmony is gone because you need to highlight the voice here. Okay, and just go to the audio and the general harmony voice and number of voice you can choose us. As, uh, up to four. Uh, what's different between three and four? Three is the soprano, alto, tenor, and four is plus the bass. Okay, if you do not need the bass, it's three. But personally, I don't think bass is very useful um, uh, for the uh, the general way. It doesn't sound very well, but uh, all three sounds very good. All right, so um, you want to open the sample editor uh, after completion. You can do that. If not, you can uncheck. Alright, so uh, just say uh, we want to do that. Okay, so that's kit okay. And we're analyzing and creating the three harmony here. Okay. And in my case I only have three, so it's just going to uh recreate that another three. I did this before, um like multiple harmony with the same same voice track and I as soon as I did um uh, the second round, which is a additional one from the, the same exact voice, I got error message. Okay, so it looks like it's okay. You can see that a three harmony voice is being generated. Okay, and you open the uh, uh, editor. Uh, you don't need them, you just minimize them. Okay. Alright, so it's still okay. It, it just got the, it's something, not error message, just kind like of warning. Uh, 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 like you already have uh, the uh, source being the harmony being generated, so it just kind of repeat again. So it's warning like that. Okay, of course, I don't need additional because I already have them. So I'm going to highlight them and remove select track. All right. So I just move, remove them. But this one I show you how to do how to add the uh, harmony. So once you harmony, okay, you can see uh, some of the why because I I actually um, uh, disable the uh, the sound, and so you can mute the sound. Okay, that's how I do that. And uh, you can unmute or mute using the shift on your keyboard and press M uh, to mute, and shift on the keyboard and press U to unmute. Okay, uh, that's not today subject. Today subject is show you how to work in a harmony. And once you have harmony. Uh, in place, okay. You can actually in your song you can kind of add harmony. Like for example, this part has no harmony. You can see here is um, a disable, so you can you don't see anything. But here we're gonna see the harmony. All right, right now um, I'm working on the harmony. Uh, there's some harmony that I need to um, working on. Uh, for example, I'm just going to enable all the music background so I can hear everything, and that will actually help me to uh, make a judge. You know, see if that is a good. Uh, good uh, uh, voice, good uh, audio not. So I'm going to do is uh, go to the place which is I actually want to... Uh, Alright, <coughs> All right, uh, you can see here um, the recording sound here seems fine. You can actually change that if you want to. Um, mm. Okay, all right. Um, sounds sounds okay. Cause I was thinking about the, 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 this is. Oh, this is harmony. Actually, how do I generate this harmony? This one actually, what I did is using the voice, and I just using the 
well, this is actually not the different like tenor, uh, alto, soprano. No, this is actually sorry. This is actually just harmony, just pure harmony. You know, what I do is it's just you can export the uh, audio mix down. You know, and uh, choose just uh, the main voice here. Okay, and just ex export the uh, wave file, the voice file. Once you export the file, then you can. Uh, once you export, okay, you ask you and show you, and uh, you ask you the location. Well, my location already set. Okay, and then you can use in the file. Just export and click open. Okay, and you will just open here. And the way you create the harmony for your uh, own voice, you can just move the move the sound move the sound like a little bit back so you can actually sing like a one two three and one two three kind of like uh, in sequence that's what I did over here okay I'm gonna mute it. that's what I did on the uh, on this song at the two or the end and what I did is just I just kind of import uh, import uh, the uh, the uh, audio file main audio file that this one harmony and uh, I will just just kind of editing, making the different positions, so you can to produce like a main voice and repeat, and to repeat here again. Okay, so that ba that basically is how I how I do it. All right, uh, thank you so much for watching. You have a very good day. Bye bye.